we all grew up with being told that when the time is right, something will happen. I pray that this year is your time. I pray that God touches you, and I pray that everything comes together in a perfect way. This is your time. It is your time to shine. Now the turning of a calendar page doesn't make the difference. What makes the difference is you deciding in mind to make it your time. You deciding in mind that it is not a rehash of yesterday's years, that it is a new you in a new time. And that is the truth. God speaks to you and says that you have never lived in this time before. This time is fresh and it is clean, it's pure, it's new. It's for you to mold in the way that you choose to mold it. And you choose to mold it with God to do great things. I pray that God will give you a vision of what your time can be. I pray that your time is a time of harvest and that it is a time of real joy, not an artificial joy, not a temporal joy, but a continuous, ever-expanding joy that you feel and, and others feel it when they're around you. I pray that you will have God coming through you so much in 2015 that other people will be changed and uplifted because they are in your presence. And they will feel the joy. And they'll feel an exhilaration of power because they are with you. I pray that everyone feels good in your presence and, most of all, that you feel good in your presence, that you feel good in your own skin, that you're comfortable with who you are and what God is doing coming through you. I pray that as you find this comfort, as you find this well-being, that you are able to express yourself in ways that you've never even dreamed of doing before, great ways bigger ways. I pray that you live a truly big life, a large life, that every part of you is expressing God. The greatest gift that any of us can have is another day, time. It is the, the standard of everything. As I've said before, it's not the gold standard, it's the time standard. Having time to do the things that you want to do. I pray that you do this year because I decree in Jesus Christ's name, this is your time. And you decree it through your consent and through your acceptance of that idea and through allowing God to come through every single thought inside of your mind, the energy inside of your body. There is nothing that is stopping this now inside of you. No resistance, only a willingness to fully express, to fully live, to fully enjoy to fully allow the success of God to be made manifest in you as you. It is so. We decree it in Jesus Christ's name. Amen and amen.